Hello and welcome back to our channel. I'm Danish, and you are watching Iraqi Dinar YouTube channel. Hopefully you all will be fine let's start today. The Iraqi dinar has long been a subject of speculation and debate due to Iraq's economic and political challenges. Currently operating under a managed float system, the dinar's value is influenced by the Central Bank of Iraq, which aims to maintain stability within the country. However, this system has limited the dinar's competitiveness on the global stage hindering its potential as an international currency. Intel guru Frank 26's insights suggest a forthcoming shift towards a fixed international rate for the dinar. This move would peg the dinar's value against major currencies like the US dollar or euro, providing a stable benchmark for international transactions. Such stability could enhance investor confidence making Iraq a more attractive destination for foreign direct investment. Businesses would benefit from predictable exchange rates, facilitating smoother trade and investment flows. Moreover, a fixed international rate could have broader macroeconomic benefits for Iraq. It could help control inflation by providing a stable pricing environment for goods and services. This stability is crucial for fostering economic growth and reducing the cost of living for Iraqi citizens. Additionally, a fixed rate would simplify financial planning and budgeting for businesses and government agencies alike, promoting fiscal discipline and economic resilience. Transitioning to a fixed international rate, however, presents significant challenges and considerations. Iraq's financial infrastructure must be robust enough to support and defend the fixed exchange rate. This includes maintaining adequate foreign exchange reserves and implementing effective monetary policies to manage fluctuations in currency demand. The Central Bank of Iraq would play a pivotal role in these efforts, ensuring liquidity and stability in the foreign exchange market. Furthermore, public perception and understanding are critical factors in the success of such a transition. Frank 26's assertion that Iraqi citizens are being prepared for this change underscores the importance of transparent communication and education. Informative campaigns and public consultations will be essential to build trust and acceptance among the population ensuring they understand the potential benefits and adjustments associated with the fixed rate system. In conclusion, while the potential introduction of a fixed international rate for the Iraqi dinar represents a significant economic opportunity, it requires careful planning, strong institutional capacity, and broad-based support to succeed. Monitoring developments in Iraq's economic policies and the central bank's actions will provide insights into how effectively the transition is managed. Ultimately, a well-executed shift to a fixed international rate could position Iraq for enhanced economic stability, increased foreign investment, and sustainable growth in the global economy.